Alexander Gustafsson just retired. Unlucky. Oh. Yeah, just swing back, you know. UFC 3 doesn't have any great mechanics, so you can just swing back if you get up. We are tie clinching with Anthony Rumble Johnson. And we are done tie clinching with Anthony Rumble Johnson. Oh, what a quick returning hook that was. I have no idea how, how I did it. Holy smokes, that counter was slow as hell. Have I mentioned that I don't like these weight classes? Anything above middleweight? Could have easily been rocked there. Why do these Russian players? always want to grab you like i don't know every one of them i must be the only exception i must be the only one that is good at anything else whoa that freaking counter just made that entire screen shake oh Whew. swing out swing out can't let him uh, break my block oh he doesn't care about stamina. Why would he? It's usually three. That, that, that did not reach him. Again! Yo! Does Anthony Rubble Johnson have like some sort of like special ability when he's catching a kick? That makes <laughs> your entire monitor just shake like crazy. Get up! Oh, I just kicked him. I think I just kicked him to the head right there. Oh! Oh, he did not block low. I thought he was gonna block low. Cause I will probably not knock him out in those final seconds. But I can't take a huge chunk of stamina when he's like down like that on stamina. So, but. He did not give a crap. Oof. That uppercut had literally set him down. Same replay. Okay, let's get into the next round. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm knocking him out this time. I'm knocking him out this round. Let's dance around him. No thanks. Just at the tip, with the tip of my toes. Distance, distance, distance management. He just switched to low, but he was just out of range. Otherwise, that kick would have caught him. Ooh. 
He's returning fire. He's he's a madman. This guy doesn't have overhands. Yep, he does. Bro, you have no stamina. You have no stamina, and you're rocked. And you're gonna rock me back. That is wild. Hey, Gustafson is actually more fun to use than I remember. And like the last time I played him, I used him in UFC 3. I don't remember him being so fluid. So it's very fun to uh, use his footwork. Feels good. Feels good. Alright, I didn't fight another Alexander. Gustafsson fight, Gustafsson, Gust Gust Gustafsson fight, but I got a future fighter, Tony Ferguson, at uh, lightweight, just gonna fight soon, yes. cowboy, but as of right now, he's about to get knocked out, but it's a four year player in UFC 3, or easy. Bro, what is it? 2018? I'm good. I'm good. I don't need your hooks in my face right now. Okay, you know I can throw up. And elbows. This is a wild. This is wild. What you got? You got something for me? Oh, body knees. What you referring? That's that's what you're going with now. Big miss. Big miss. A little focus. I don't. I really don't want to lose today. I think the guy's dead. You have to duck down in order to avoid a round horse kick. Hey, uh, Dan Courts, if you're watching this video, duck down in order to evade sideways moving strikes, such as a round horse kick. Duck down. You're welcome. All right, that was enough of UFC 3 for the day for me. Uh, yeah, like the video, comment if you have the time. Um, subscribe if you haven't yet. If you have yet, make sure to hit that uh, bell thing. You know, the, that thing that made Daenerys Targaryen go crazy bitch mode on King's Landing. 
and I will see you guys tomorrow.